Hello. Welcome to another session where we learn subtraction of numbers in an easy way. Subtraction means deducting something. Okay. So, welcome to our channel Sorelia's Art and Craft. It's a channel where you can learn so many things with fun. Subscribe it and Did you now learn subtraction for that we need digits okay 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 and it'll set 20 come on so we need only this up to this okay now sum is what is subtraction you have four balls okay now given someone two balls so how much you'll have you had four balls one two three four you given someone one two and how much you'll have okay minus so four one two three four given two one two how much remain one two so it will be two so if you this, do this in mathematical four plus two how much so we are in four given one two minus it's a reverse counting you had four you're given one so you're in three you're given another one you're in two so it will be two okay now let us do another one see thirty five minus twelve how much so write everything in ones tens hundred form okay thirty five five three minus twelve one two so we'll take one digit at a time okay now we are in 2, we are in 5, we need to minus 2, we are in 5, 5 minus 2, 4, 3, 5, 4, 3, so it will be 3. Now 3 minus 1, we are in 3 minus 1, 2, so answer will be 23, got it? Now if we do 6, 5, 1 minus 6, 5, 4 minus 2, 0 1 okay once tens hundred six five four minus two zero one okay so you are in four minus one four minus one four three five minus zero nothing minus so it will be exactly five six minus two you are in six minus two 1, 2, so it will be 4. So answer will be 4, 5, 3. Start something complex than this. Okay. 2, 0, 9, 1, minus 6, 5, 8. Okay. Is equal to how much? See, now we're going complex. 1, tens, 100, 1000. Okay, so we can write 2091 minus 658. Okay, minus C. So it will be 2091 minus 658. Okay, minus C. Here comes. Okay, now you're in 1. How can you minus 8? You're in 1. How can you minus 8? 1 minus 0. Nothing you have. It's stop. End of the road. You have nothing to give. So you borrow. 10 from this if you take 10 make it 8 so if you borrow 10 from this what will this will happen 1 plus 10 it will come up to 11 okay so it will be 11 1 plus 10 is 11 okay now from 11 you minus 8 11 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 3 11 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 okay got it 
now 8 minus 5 easily you can do 8 minus 5 1 2 3 4 5 it will be 3 again the problem is that you are in 0 you have to minus 6 can you do that no then we will borrow 10 you have 0 you have borrowed 10 what will be it will be 10 10 so it will be 10 10 minus 6 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 it will be 4 10 Nine eight seven six five four. Question six zero nine five four three minus two one eight nine eight five. Okay, is equal to how much? So what we'll do first we'll place these numbers in order: ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Okay, so it'll be sixty thousand, six lakh nine thousand. Okay, ten thousand, then lakhs. Okay, hundred thousand. Okay, six zero nine five four three minus. Okay. Two one eight nine eight five. We need to do minus. Okay, so let us do it. Huh? What do we need to do? We are in three. We have to minus five. Can you do three to minus five? So three. What we will do? We will borrow 10 from this. So it will be 13. Borrow 10. It will be 13. Now you can easily minus 5. 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You are in 8. 13. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. Got my point? You are in 8. Okay. Now we will do another thing. You are in 3. Can you minus 8 from 3? You have only 3. You are here. You have nothing to minus. So, another will borrow 10 from here. So, it will be 13. Borrow 10. 3 plus 10. So, it will be 13. 13 minus 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. It will be... No. For 13 minus 8. Okay. You have 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It will be 5. Okay. Okay. Now, again 4. You have to min minus 9. So can, can you do that? No. So what you do? You make this 8. You make this 14. From 14. 4. You have borrowed 10. It goes to 14. From 14 you can easily minus 9. Because you have 14. Plenty you have. 14. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. You will win 5. From 14 just come back. 14. 13. 12. 11. 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Okay. So you are in 5. Now let us do one thing. Now we are in 8 minus 8. You are in 8. You have nothing to minus. So you can write down 8. Again see you are in 0. But you have to minus 1. What will do? You know we will borrow 10 from this. 5. 10. So it will be 10 plus 0. 10. And from 10 you can easily minus 1 so it will be 9 and from 5 minus 2 you are in 5 minus 2 2 so it will be 3 so the answer will be 3 9 8 5 5 8 what my point it's very easy minus is something you have minus 3 ok so you have 5 minus 3 1 2 3 4 5 minus 1 2 3 so 1 2 3 how much remain is equal to 2 main funda is that you have something you've given it out so how much you have so you got subtraction please subscribe for more videos uploaded multiplication subtraction division